You know, the power I have as a prosecutor is that with a swipe of my pen, I can charge someone with a misdemeanor, the lowest level offense possible. All because with the swipe of my pen I've tried to charge you with a crime, which I may choose to dismiss two weeks later. It's an incredible amount of power. What's going on, y'all? Man, it's King Clef holding it down for the cool tape. Man, I'm right back at you. You know what's crazy is that we tend to forget some of the most important moments that describe a person's character. I remember watching the preliminaries uh, last year. Was it? No, not, not last year. But when she was running against Biden. Uh, we're talking about Kamala Harris. And how even then we understood what her essence of her, or what the essence of her was. Where she was coming from a prosecutor and putting a lot of people behind bars. Uh, for small things such as smoking weed and things like that and knowing that she was a South Indian descent or South Indian Asian descent or something along those lines never once did I consider her a full-blown black woman uh, president you know candidate and it's crazy because she didn't even make it that far and then all of a sudden now she's in the forefront of this thing and we just seem to forget that this woman was never really for us from the get-go shocking but true if you didn't see the video that I put up just a minute ago uh, and, and you need to understand a little bit more in context check this out so I'm not gonna sit here and say I'm gonna do something that's only gonna benefit black people no because whatever benefits that black family will benefit that community and society as a whole in the country right? so yeah you saw that you heard that and man look it's very simple. You can do what you like and you can vote for what you like. But in my opinion, I think in the end of the day, we still have to look at the essence of somebody. And what they, and what I've been noticing with her is that she's a flip-flopper. She transcends to every different audience and group of people and tries to feed to that particular need or that group. And so it makes me feel like she's ingenuous and dis, uh, yeah, disingenuous. So... Uh, that's one of my things and one of the one of my holdups about trying to actually move forward with the as for being my presidential candidate. But I just wanted to bring that to you guys' attention to kind of feed you some more information just in case you were kind of undecided as well. And you know, uh, make your own choice and do what you do. But I was always support uh, Donald Trump as my president going forward. So I just wanted to shout out to you guys and uh, give you that information. Why don't y'all guys uh, don't forget to share, like, and subscribe. And I'll catch all y'all cool kids at the cool table next time. Thank you.